again everyone. So we're off down Leventon Marina today. This is about 125 miles from my house. So that's a good old distance. Let's see what we can find. Feel like shouting at me. <laughs> right, let's get in there and have a look. So we should be coming up to the entrance any second now. Okay, there's a sign. Oh, look at that lovely sunset. Let's get that, shall we? That's a crazy sunset. Look at that. Absolutely lovely. Let's see if we can get a bit more of that further down the road. It's just an endless road and then we'll be in the actual marina. people are having a walk and stuff. It's a bit of a bumpy old road. It's knocking the camera about a bit. <laughs> we should be out of the car in a minute, so. I can see boats, I can see water, I can see places to park. Let's do it. We're out of the car. Levington Marina. It's a bit windy, so you'll have to bear with me. I'll do my best. Got a lovely sunset behind this building down there. As you can see, lots of boats. Boats everywhere you look. Where do we go first? Left, right, straight. <laughs> it's a big old place. Lovely sunset. Let's have a look off the top of here, see what we can see. Places, that's not good. <laughs> Obviously, we put the boats down. Oh, it feels a bit weird, <laughs> a bit wobbly. It's 
strange looking boat there, not sure what that's for. Lovely yacht. And loads and loads of other yachts. And all sorts of different boats. There's the thumbnail right there. <laughs> Lovely. Well, I don't like it on here, I'm going to get off here because it feels really wobbly and horrible. Can't see the fish. Not really the right time of year to see him swimming about there. Eek. There's the main harbour offices and stuff. wooden boat over here is being done up and got a Christmas tree on the roof. Pretty cool. Got all masts in that land down. Sun's almost down now. Loads more masts. Oh, it's very chilly. The bays are empty, look where the boats are out. Been took out of the water. Shorts up the top here, ones that have been asked to be taken out. Have the bottom halves repainted or just to take them out of the way of the bad weather. Can get down there onto the platforms, but there's no point because there's nothing down that one. Boat down there, it's called Gold Rush. Lovely boat. Ideal for fishing, that is. Remember this old boat that used to be down in the head switch docks? It's the old cadet's boat. Ship. Lots and lots of boats up this end. Sun's now going down behind the trees over the back there. Eh? 
so it could go down there and walk along the platforms, but then you won't be able to see as much. We've got the marina here, then just the other side of the marina. You can see over the top there is the River Orwell. If you look further down there, you should be able to see a bit better in a minute. You've got Felixstowe Docks and Shotley Marina around the other side. That's windy, you can know, hear the click, click, click of the mast. I think you've got like a toilet and shower block or whatever over this side, I think. Looks like that. Oh, it's absolutely freezing. I'm shaking. <laughs> Millions and millions of pounds worth of boats. <laughs> All look really nice fun. Go out on the river. You can even go further down there and run through Felixstowe and out actually onto the main sea. It's quite cool. There's a load more out the water here. Meringue down there. Sun's nearly gone. It's going to go dark on me. Just on the edges down here. Just all parked up for the winter. I bet it's lovely down there in the summer. where a lot of the trailers are put. We've got the main river down the bottom here. way down. The 
that yellow one there would do nicely as a fishing boat for us, huh? <laughs> Perfect. Oh, that wind's literally ice cold, it's cutting right through me. Hello, birdies, ducks, swans. Turns, oyster catches, all sorts. <laughs> wonder what's in amongst all this lot down here. Find out one day, we'll take a wander along the mud flat along there. Come down maybe in the summer next year. And we'll have a little lift up with some of this stuff and see what's down there, shall we? I think that's a good idea. I'll say yes in the comments below. That's the river all well. You can see in the distance down there, that's Felixstowe Docks. If you go past there, you come out into the main sea. Over that side of the water is Shotley Marina. And then if you carry on around there, you get to Harridge, Dovercourt, and them sort of areas. If you carry on down the river down this way, you end up to Ipswich with the Aurora Bridge and all that sort of areas. My hands are going to fall off. <laughs> yeah, I'd definitely be interested to have a little look down there and see what we can find. Don't know what it'd be like to fish off here one day. Be very cold with a wind like this in your face, <laughs> northeasterly. We come down there and all the way along there. Down the I'm going to try and walk back this way. Never done it before, but. Never know. <laughs> Till you try. So we we'll have a look, we'll have a look at the boats or we'll look down the river. I think the boats are quite interesting to see. It's all different sorts. Tiny little rowing boats to yachts to big fishing boats to massive seagoing boats. This is only one side, it's a whole other side, <laughs> which is crazy. There's some cormorants down in there, doing a bit of fishing while it's about. <laughs> Let's zoom you in a bit, shall we? All I'm doing at the moment is walking along the, I don't know what you call it, I suppose it's a bit of a heath. We have got a bit of a beach down here, no starting to show. Yeah, I think that would be quite good to give that a fish there at some point. Maybe come down there for a whole day or day and a night. Definitely worth a go. In the summer you could expect some bass and uh, even a rays and stuff like that. In the end, yeah. Oh, we can go back round. We'll go all the way back round. <laughs> Has anyone been out on the river before on a boat or got your own boat down the river? Let us know in the comments below the video. Let us know what it's like in the summer and winter to be out there. Big old pipes going all the way along the side of it.
lovely place. Really nice place to keep your boat. There's the tide's going down, you can see there's more beach and more beach starting to show. Look perfect little spot for a couple of sort of flounder rods, little bath rods and a rod rest. Or even up on the top of here really. With that wind like that, cool. My hands are I'll show you. Hey. I was lucky I nearly dropped you. <laughs> My hands are like ice, they're just bright red. So we're following the pathway, the sun's gone down over there behind the trees now, but it looks really nice. As you can hear, uh, little windmill things spinning around. Starting to lose the water out of the boat yard now. Hardly feel my hands. Oh. Big old plates and chains and all sorts down here. That's where that, that pipe we've been following all the way along, right the way down, comes along here, goes all the way along the top of here, but also goes down and along there as well. Anyone know what it's for? water out of the boat yard if I get too much water in that flood or I'm guessing they're not sewage pipes or nothing like that I wouldn't have thought that's not looking good then you know it's looking like a dead end might have to pause here and walk right back around the other side. <laughs> Oop, something to take the bird. Probably a fox or something like that. You can see down the end there where the boats go out. I don't see no bridge or anything, so. And we're not swimming across because it's freezing. i 
starting to run out of light now as well. Some more of that pipe. Didn't see any boats on the river, I saw a couple earlier on. Some sailing boats. All the lights and stuff starting to come on. Dan Felix doing now. Definitely not looking good for getting across. <laughs> Look at all the mud. Yummy. Sorry if I'm a bit shaky, but I'm literally shaking them. Frozen. Birds all popping out of all sorts of places along here. Got little dens and stuff, little nests. And this is as far as I can walk, but it looks things. Crazy marina, it's a lovely place. So I've walked all the way along the island bit again now everyone, I'm right back down this end again. <laughs> Which is nice. There's actually a boat. Now coming in the marina over there. Should be able to just see that. It's just come flying along the river and slowed down to come into the marina. Don't know if it's a fishing boat just been out or just been out for a cruise. But my hands and everything are like ice now, so I'm gonna start wandering back down this side. I'll bring you back in every now and again to have a little look along this side. And then we're gonna head back down to the car. Everything's getting dark. That sky in the background looks brilliant. That sunset going down. All the lights are coming on on the boats and on the posts and the walkways and stuff. We'll have to revisit this one in the summer, I think. Do a nice little walk around. We can walk around in the shorts and t-shirt. We're not shaking. <laughs> Get the rod stand on the front there. Maybe even be out in the river. On the sib, would be cool.
water's gone really still in here now. Got the wind still whisking away on the island a bit. Still windy here to be honest, but that's flat calm down in there. See all Felix, they're all lit up now. Carriage over the other side shortly. We're back down to the big old cadet ship. Parked outside the gate, so we're not going to get locked in or anything. So the old moon come out up there. Just a tiny bit of moon tonight. Hardly anything. Alright everyone, we're going to leave it there. Thank you very much for coming in, appreciate that. Hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you all soon in the next one. Bye for now.